the internet. My name is Lisanne and welcome to my channel. It is mid-April and that means two things. One, it's almost Coachella. And two, this is the exact, like today, like 14th of April, the exact day that I made my first YouTube video and that was two years ago. But if you do like my channel, which I hope you do, make sure to hit that subscribe button down below. I would love if you joined my little YouTube family. And if you like this video, then make sure to give it a thumbs up. Now, like I was saying earlier, it's almost Coachella. And last year I did like a boho lookbook. This year I thought I might do a makeup tutorial because I really just wanted to try to do a makeup look. So let's get started. So I've got my little cat ears in to get the hair out of my face. Now I actually found this back. This is really, really old. Um, we used to have it for like playing around as kids and it's just this roll on glitter. It just comes with this little roll on ball like some deodorants do and then it just gets some glitters and I thought this would be really fun to use it as like freckles so I'm going to try to do that with this I'm probably not gonna work out but let's try it there is this kind of glue thingy in it that makes it like very sticky and wet so I'm first gonna let that dry and then I'm going to show you guys a close-up because I think it worked out pretty well um, I think it looks really cute. The sad thing is though that I don't think you can get it anymore. It's really really old and but I am going to tell you the brand and I'm gonna see if I can find it. I'm sorry but I'm probably not gonna be able to find it but it is from the Hema which is a store that's only basically available in the Netherlands and Belgium and I just recently found out in France too so if you live there you probably know the store and um, I'm gonna look if they have it online to start with the eyes I'm using my Fort Morphe 35k palette and I'm just using a very neutral light brown this light one and this darker one I'm mixing those two as my transition shade and just using the deluxe crease brush by Real Techniques I'm just going to blend that in my upper crease Now I'm going to take this middle dark brown here and I'm going to dark up the crease, focusing mostly on the outer edge. Because I have hooded lids, I apply it just above my crease instead of in my crease. Now I'm going to apply this very light gold shade onto my eyelid, just with my finger. I'm focusing it a lot on the inner part of my eyelid. Now I'm going to use this Kiko Milano eyeshadow on the outer part of my lid. And this is in the color 03 and it's a beautiful dark coppery shade. I'm also going to apply that with my finger. Now that is totally not blended. So I'm just going to grab a brush and blend them together. Now I'm going to go back in with my dense blending brush and I'm going to blend everything nicely together. Because I feel like the gold has gone lost a little bit, I'm going to apply some more on my eyelid and then also apply some in the inner corner. Now for the fun part, I am going to grab the 23 Kiko Milano eyeshadow shade in this like denim -y blue and a smudger brush and I'm just going to smudge that right under my eye. 
I changed up my brush because the other one was a little bit fat. This is the accent brush from Real Techniques. Well, I really like that, but I'm wanting just a little bit more blue. So I'm just going to take my colorful palette and uh, apply just a little bit more blue. Now the blue really pops. Now we're just adding some mascara and we are done with the eye look. Now the eye look is done. I think the gold freckles go super nicely with the gold lid and the blue goes perfectly with my blue pants that I'm wearing. This outfit is actually going to be in one of my future videos, probably the next. So stay tuned and if you really want to know what that video is, then definitely make sure to click the bell and you'll get notified as soon as it comes up. Now I have another really fun thing for your face, something a little bit extra and it involves a paintbrush and white face paint. So this is really cute, I think. What you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna grab the end of your paintbrush or brush or whatever, and you're gonna dip it in some white face paint. Make sure this is face paint and not wall paint. Now what I'm going to do is I'm gonna apply little dots all over my forehead. Well, not all over my forehead, but or along my brow bone. It doesn't have to be perfect, but I do recommend making it symmetrical. Now, this is how it looks. It just kind of looks like a crown on your head, and I just really like it. I like any kind of golden glitters on your cheeks. I just really like that little extra thing, you know, that's different with festivals. Now, we only have two more things to do, and that is highlighter and lipstick. For a highlighter, I'm going to use this new highlighter. It's this strobing stick from Essence, and it comes in a little round stick form like this, and it's like this really nice blinding champagne color, and I thought I would have used a little bit more of a blinding highlight for this look than an everyday highlight, so I'm going to be using this. I just apply it to the cheeks like this, and then I gently rub it in with my fingers. Now look at that glow. Now the very last thing is lipstick or like any kind of lip product. And I'm going to be using Echo Park from Colourpop because it's my favorite liquid lipstick so I just want to wear that. And because it's an ultra satin, meaning it doesn't dry, I'm going to put a little bit of glitter on it just to make everything a little bit extra because I'm super extra. Definitely when it comes to Coachella where I can be all out if I want to. Now I'm going to take that gold again and just put a little bit on my lips to make them sparkle. Giving it some glitter was actually just really really fun and it's a fun way to change up a lip color. Now this is the finished look. Uh, you can't forget the flower crown and you are totally ready for Coachella. I love this look. I love the blue under eye. I love the golden freckles. I love the white crown eyebrow thingy. I love the metallic lip. I just, I just really like this look even though it's not something you would wear daily. I mean, if you do, it's totally okay. I mean, it's beautiful, but I, I think that for a special festival, you can go a little bit out and you can um, try something new. And I do really recommend doing that because it's a ton of fun. A woodland fairy and it's making me incredibly happy I don't know why it's not like I ever wanted to be a woodland fairy but like now that I am it is beautiful 
But anyway, thank you guys for watching. I really hope you liked this video, that you found any kind of tips and tricks, or you found something new to try, and or just inspiration. And if you do try out this look, uh, make sure to tag me in it. I will put my social media links down below. If you did like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. And if you aren't already subscribed to my channel, make sure to do so. And uh, I love you guys.